Hey, it's W5HRO. Well, back to this NCC-2 uh, noise reduction unit, phasing unit. It's kind of dark back here, I apologize, but I did get all the boards for this thing on both sides, both channels. I got the 75 to 50 ohm adapter. Then below that I got that receiver guard, which is that protection door board with all the diodes and everything. And I've got one right across on the other side on channel A. And on the bottom I got the 160 meter high pass filters to make sure nothing gets through or gets really attenuated. Anything down below where it starts rolling off around 1.8 megacycles. It cuts it off about uh, 1.65, 1.7 I believe. So, uh, But I wanted to show you right now the 20 meter band is not open. And uh, it was open earlier. Right now 17 is really open. I just clicked down here to show you what it does with my noise. See how clean that looks now? Well, let me show you what happens when I put this thing, I turn it off. Let me turn the sound up too so you can kind of hear. Oh my God, hear that? And look at it. I've got some bad interference around here someplace. Now watch. I'll take it back off. I mean, I'll, I mean, I'll, I'll put the the NC2, uh, the NCC2 back in line. Look at that. I can tune that completely out. There's just some little remnants of it here. You can see a little bit. I think I have the contrast on this waterfall set a bit too bright. Anyway, I need to. I'm, I've still been a. I made the mistake. I should have left it where it was set at the factory, and I play. I hit. I hit one of the sliders by mistake one day, and it kind of. Uh, it kind of messed me up, and I've been trying to get it back where it was. I've got it close, but there's too much contrast. There's a little bit too much intensity. You wouldn't even see that if uh, if I had it set back to where it was originally. But uh, it works. There's just no activity. And what I've got is I have my tw you know I have that 20 meter dipole hanging off that uh, that vertical. You know, it's, it's insulated from the vertical and the ground. The, 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 everything is you know isolated from that vertical when I'm on the vertical by itself. But uh, I'm, I'm tuned up on the 20 meter dipole right now. And I'm phasing that for the main, it's the main antenna and I'm phasing that with the loop. See where I've got the balance? So uh, it works great. I just have to, you know, the antennas themselves hear a lot more than the loop. So I have to always attenuate the uh, either my vertical or the dipole at least 10 dB. I also did put up the uh, dual band 10, 10 and six meter Moxum. And I'm still trying to get my SWR set on that. And I can just switch it. If the coax is hanging right below the transmitter, I can just switch it, you know, to where it, uh, I can switch over to it just by changing the coax. I'm going to put a switch probably back behind there for now so I can click it back and forth. But I do have that up. I don't have the rotor cable hooked up here to the, uh, I've got one more of these RCA control boxes. So it's pointed st almost straight north right now. So I'm still getting a lot of noise on 10. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to eliminate it, but I got to try rotating the beam and play around with it some more. But this thing does work. You saw it. I mean, look. Off. Oh my God, you hear that? You hear how loud that is? And then off. If the band was open, it'd be great. So anyway, that's all for now. I, uh, I just put the boards in this morning I just got around to it so I'm going to put the lid back on this thing and uh and uh, put the watt meter back in line and hook every, all my stuff up so I can get back on the air on transmit again and uh then I'll just keep playing with the antennas themselves I may put up another receiving antenna I may put up one of the straight vertical they make an amplified uh uh, mass mount amplify just a little vertical whip that sticks up in the air too for these things so I may put one of those up and play around with it on the other end of the house eventually and see what that does but uh, so far so good but so let me get this thing all hooked back up and uh, this will and then my, then this is what part two of this video then I'll do some more detailed uh, you know demonstrations of this thing when I have time and do like a part you know three four etc as I go so that's all for now. This is W5HRO 73s.